Good afternoon once again and uh, today on the uh, on the Matchbox channel uh, we're going to start with the number fives. Um, the first of the number fives is the, um, the Route Master bus. This is the 5C, so the third one in the Matchbox range. Uh, the 5A and the 5B again were MoCo early Lesney issues and represented you know a sort of basic type uh, London bus. Uh, when we got to the 5C and the 5D it was the route master that was uh, was represented and uh, they did they did a nice job of that I think. Uh, only came in the D box the the 5C route master. Uh, early issue D box and sort of slightly later issue D boxes. Uh, Grey and black wheels with different uh, decal variations. Uh, matching box artwork, visco static, uh, grey or black wheels. It sort of shows between a, a grey and a black. I, I, I plumped for a grey there, but a black may have been uh, probably better. Uh, the pair drax is a, a very, very hard to find ver uh, variation. So if you've got one of these, then uh, you know you're quite you're quite lucky. Um, I've only ever had two, um, and one is um, in my collection. And we have the Baron of Beef, uh, Beef, Baron of Beef decal. Uh, which has the mecha decals on on the reverse side, which also came on the on the 5D as well. Um, so that covers the uh, the 5C uh, bus. And on this post, um, because it's a very similar model, I'm going to include the 5D as well. And we will just uh, click on this one. Um, so again, Route Master bus, and but basically what they did, they scaled it up. Um, so it's, a, it's physically a bigger model. It's essentially, you know, a very similar casting, but they've, they, they've made it probably about, I don't know, 25% bigger. And to accommodate that, then they've produced a, a bigger um, E-box. Uh, only came in E-boxes and F-boxes, and as you will see there, we have a range of the different E-boxes. Essentially, the artwork is on the front is the same, um, so it only shows the long life um, uh, decal. Uh, you'll see here the very early E1 new model N flap. Uh, later we have uh, without the new. And then we have the the E3 and E4. Um, a lot of people overlook the, the uh, these two N flap because when, it, when, you, when you first look at it, they sort of look quite similar, but they're not. They, they are different formats. Um, as you can see here, the early E3, the number is actually in the middle of the box here, and there's no Matchbox logo at the top. Uh, on the E4 here, you will see the um, the Matchbox logo um, um, here as well. Uh, then the last issue uh, before we went to super fast was the the F box. The, the, the F box out of these is probably the hardest to find, and you'll see it here with the matching um, Visco Static um, artwork. So that, that's a nice one to have because it because uh, it completely matches. Um, there's also a lot of sort of label and decal variations that I didn't put in the collection. Uh, and again, that was purely down to my, my own personal choice, really. I mean, I know there's a P-gram one, which is, you know, it's, which is quite rare, and there's, there's, there's a few others. But, you know, it was drawing the line somewhere. And, and having five uh, number 5D route masters uh, with, with five actual different style boxes, for me, you know, that, that ticked the boxes for me. So, uh, that was so, so that satisfied my collecting uh, habits. So that's the um, 5C and 5D bus, and the next post I'll do will be the 5E Lotus Europa. See you then. Bye.